Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich! Welcome back to Let's Play Plants vs. Zombie for the Zombies for the PS3. We just got the repeater, which is going to completely replace our pea shooter. We no longer need- I, I will no longer be using the pea shooter because that's just the way I roll. And we'll start, that's fine. I got a pretty good hit. These, these levels, the first levels, go slowly enough. Now this is the last level before a boss level. The levels are in sets of 10, there are 50 levels to the game. Or at least to the PC version, there are 50 levels. I'm assuming this is the same. I've only practice played this up to about level 25. But we're definitely going to need, now we're going to need a lot of sunflowers. Because the pea shooters, or the, the repeaters, they, uh, they're as strong as two pea shooters, but they only take up one space. And that's great. But they cost twice as much. It's a bargain, trust me. This is definitely something you want to spend your sun on. Yeah, see how the sun goes to our cursor? It's very weird. And by weird, I mean convenient and awesome. Because then we can do that. Alright, we're almost to the point. Yeah. And yeah, now we can put down a sunflower and a repeater. Which we will do because we know where the next zombie's coming from because those bushes are awesome. Alright, that's all the sun we want. Alright, now this could be a problem. I mean, it's not because we have potato mines. But, uh, it could be. Theoretically, if you were prepared for it. But I am, because I'm like a Boy Scout. I'm like a Plants vs. Zombie Boy Scout. Yeah, and this will take out a Conehead easily by itself. Also, one of these with a Snow Pea will uh, take down a Buckethead, I believe. Oh, I don't know if we're going to... We'll make him jump, just to be safe. And then we'll put this on our unprotected row. Again, just to be safe. Well, we might actually kill him with the potato mine. Boom! Spadow! I do like that. Alright. So now it's all about slowing things down and hitting them twice. So this is essentially like having double coverage with the pea shooters on every row. Just, you know, with the one we've got. Now we have yet to get our first bucket head, thankfully. Uh, we'll, be in, we'll be in really great shape if he comes on the uh, row that already has the walnut on it. Because I don't think he can take on a walnut and... If he comes to the bottom row, I might be in a little bit of trouble. I can always... Well, right now, I can drop. It doesn't matter. We're not getting him yet. Oh, he did come on the walnut row. That's awesome. And now I have double coverage there. And as soon as I can put out another repeater, I'll be hitting him with five shots a turn. That'll teach him to have a bucket on his head. He's even smarter than the Conehead zombie, making him even more dangerous. I think that's as smart as they get. No, I take that back. There's going to be a level, a water level later, and there are bucket heads with inner tubes. Those guys are geniuses. Geniuses! Yeah, we're in great shape now. It's all downhill from here. And by downhill, I mean, well, I don't know. It's all easy zombie murder from here. Wait, is it murdering the... Uh, can you murder the undead? Is that the way it works? Oh, uh, we're gonna... We're gonna cream this bucket head. Watch. Well, you don't have to watch. You can just listen to me talk. I could sing public domain songs. She'll be coming round and round. I just ran out of stuff to say. That was the thing that made me run out of stuff to say. Can you believe it? Oh, I guess I'm talking again, so... 
Oh wow. Well. It was it was sweet while it lasted. Vertical sandwich was silent! That's right. That's right. Yeah, this is in this is impenetrable with the zombie technology they have right now. Later there will be different zombies. And they will be horrible. So there is seven shots a turn for that zombie. For that fro look at that. His bucket didn't even stay into the first square. It's not even fair what we're doing to these zombies. Now let's see if the lawnmowers turn into gold in these first levels. When the level's over, on some levels, I, I, I assume it's all of them. The lawnmowers that haven't been used, because if a zombie gets to a lawnmower, the lawnmower drives forward, mowing over all zombies in the row. Uh, but the ones that aren't used should turn into like $50 a piece and add to our bank. But I'm not sure about that. They do not this early in the game. So now we are about to launch an all out attack on your house. Sincerely, the zombies. So now the, the fifth and tenth level of every set will be different in that uh, the fifth level will be a mini game, and I think the tenth level will always be you don't get to decide. You can't choose what you plant. The game just gives you things on this conveyor belt. It's supposed to be a conveyor belt. I guess. This one will almost all be... Yeah, we're doubling these up. We're gonna need it. All right, we're gonna wait until... We're gonna wait and see where we're gonna need the next set. There. There. All right, all rows. That's not gonna matter, cause I'd like to get, you know what? All right, we have a repeater on every row. Put a chopper behind this thing. All right, we've got great coverage now. Uh, I think probably right here. For a while, we will be running kind of anything we get. Uh, and then I'll be replacing the uh, pea shooters with repeat. And we want to get a snow pee in every row, obviously. This is a great example. This guy's going out. Yeah. So is this guy. There we go. That's what we want right there. Chompers behind. Uh... And then what I'll start doing is I'll start actually uh, using the, the pea shooters as... Uh... Kind of as walnuts. And I'll be putting the snow peas out here too. Just to freeze zombies. It takes them a while to eat them. I know this doesn't seem to make sense. It does indeed make sense. Alright, get rid of the one off. Put this here. All right. Look at that. Yeah, because the snow peas, you don't want them taking up space behind. Oh no! I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do that. Uh, yeah, we don't want the we don't want the one-offs taking up valuable space we can use 
for guys who shoot two shots at once. Oh, I was hoping. There we go. These guys got nothing on me now. They could try to get through all this stuff. They won't. They will get through a lot of it one plant at a time. But I'm not really worried about that. Hey, as long as we put garbage plants out here, it really holds them back. major damage. It's not... And these plants do get a chance to do some damage. You know, before they get eaten. Alright, we get a good... A good chopper defense going on here, but we're almost at the final wave. Alright. Oh no! Not what I wanted. Yeah, see, this guy could actually... This guy's kind of extra. You guys asked for it. We could be doing this as well. Just put down our... There we go. Alright! When we come back, we're gonna see what this mushroom does. Shoot short-range spores at the enemy. Bye, everybody.